so this is the latest official uh, fixel experience plus uh, os uh, running on our beloved uh, uh, xiaomi mi a2 jasmine proud on 20 on january 2019 i received the ota update and i installed the fixel experience uh, which is uh, 28th build and the process uh, took some time but it was uh, smooth this build is running on the latest and the greatest android 13 with the uh, january uh, 2023's uh, security patch the kernel here is scarlet uh, x 7.0 which is based on uh, 4.19.267 we will see more about uh, the performance in a minute or two so boot animation here is uh, same like every other google fixel uh, fixel os or something just a google logo first we will see the drm status drm wise it is enabled by uh, enabled by uh, this one and it has the level 3 support uh, you can uh, stream the 380 uh, sorry 360 or 480p uh, content on this uh, device here it is showing as uh, 540 pixel uh, i didn't test it because i don't have the subscription of netflix or amazon prime next we'll uh, see the uh, geekbench so geekbench wise we got the uh, 324 for single core and the 1402 for uh, multi core uh, here uh, for the vulcan uh, computational we got uh, 200 scores which is really really less i was uh, not sure why it was less and then it showed one or two uh, cases got failed when i was checking it the case called zero for horizon detection got failed which is uh, zero which uh, typically uh, affected the uh, overall score as 200 in takila os we got the 320 in single core and the 1450 as multi core and we got uh, 620 in computational so there are some issues but uh, still uh, this is uh, not that uh, much to worry about and then i also have uh, tried the uh, 3d mark which i was unable to run it was uh, constantly uh, for stopping or uh, it is not at all uh, working it is showing there are some background apps are running something like that so what i did i just restarted the device and then i again uh, tried to do the benchmark but uh, the 3d mark was not uh, <laughs> ready to run it just continuously closing so there is something uh, wrong or some issues with the graphical oriented uh, things i believe which is uh, making this to four stop the same case happened with the uh, geekbench which uh, we got really worst score possible for this device so on the camera to api well camera to api is enabled by default so i even uh, Installed the my beloved uh, 4.5 version uh, Google camera, which is working uh, perfectly fine. I took uh, some photos. Don't see, it, so don't see. It. it is working fine. So yes, Google camera working fine. And CTS well, uh, CTS also passes by uh, uh, default. I have also installed the HDFC app and uh, other uh, payment apps, which is uh, perfectly working fine and the eighth thing is the encryption so it is fully encrypted so yeah uh, ninth thing netmonster well uh, netmonster uh, i have uh, tested it and the thing is carrier aggregation is not working and the speed in the airtel sim card is uh, very very uh, not ideal so i was using it for some three four days today is the fourth day so till now i didn't uh, see any uh, any extra bands so this is what the speed i got 1.31 mbps and uh, this one it is in uh, airtel that is fine and i also tested this one there is only uh, one band uh, connecting for both the things so that is there and i also have uh, checked it with the geo geo is fine in my location so it is there so usually i'll get a 30 mbps or something but yeah network speed is slow with this room and day to day performance well day to day performance wise i would say i i'm uh, i it is not like uh, you will get the uh, world's best uh, experience or something but but for this uh, 3 4 year old device uh, the speed and uh, things are i'm pretty much uh, happy about it sometimes it takes some time but it won't stop it won't uh, just glitch or something it takes some time to process the things in the back end but 
uh, more or less uh, it is uh, pretty much a stable and uh, usable one in my opinion and gaming so we'll do the gaming also in the end which i will cut it here and paste it here this is future college alarm so i have said it uh, it doesn't have game mode or something but it has a game uh, dashboard option if you search games it is coming but unfortunately bgm is not uh, in the play store so <laughs> they don't consider this as a game so our uh, this one may not work uh, that game dashboard and it is uh, playable at uh, balanced and uh, high frame rate so yeah and battery backup well battery backup i have used this three three years so it got uh, reduced a bit it is not because of the rom or something i am using it for a long time so i may need to consider a battery swap but this phone yeah we'll see that one and battery backup wise i was getting like uh, maximum four hours uh, screen on time i would say with uh, 15 minutes of uh, gaming and other things the stat so four hours 40 minutes till seven percentage was uh, there uh, but um four hours max at, um, at max four hours you can get three and a half hours is uh, normally it goes so which is really really less but other roms also giving like that so my battery has some issues we'll see good things about this first good thing it is official so you will get all the updates in the future even i did i got uh, one update uh, today and uh, made this one second it is uh, stock android so yeah of course <laughs> it is stock android pixel experience plus third thing that i have noticed is uh, i want to tell it isn't bad thing but uh, uh, I you know that uh, network monitor indicator right what I do whether it is there or not I will usually check it in the here as monitor I will search it but nothing has came like uh, here so I decided like uh, there is no network monitor indicator uh, in this one and I was about to write it in the bad things <laughs> <laughs> of this one okay also uh, now the battery percentage is here but earlier it was not there when i was trying to enable this battery percentage what you try uh, you will try it in percentage right that battery percentage also was not uh, showing so what i did is i went to the battery option usually the battery uh, enabling the battery uh, percentage will be in the will be under the battery section you don't believe me but uh, here it is uh, it is pixel uh, experience pixel os so it's not experience plus 
here if i go to battery here you can see right battery option so like that i thought and uh, i just checked here also the battery ba uh, percentage option is not at all there so but <laughs> uh, i was like two, two days without even seeing the battery percentage i was using the device but i just uh, when i was going through all the settings and all for other purpose i inside the system we have something called status bar okay in that status bar we have this uh, tap to sleep option and uh, battery backup hiding this one even you have the battery style uh, options and the better thing is you also have the network uh, traffic monitor so yeah fixal experience plus so these are some of the important thing that you are getting in here so this is one of the great uh, good thing but i would suggest if they would have uh, put it in the battery itself in inside the battery but that is fine you will get through it if you are using fixel experience plus make sure you visit to <laughs> system and the status bar option and enable the battery percentage and the network uh, monitor indicator so these are some good things it is stable and you can use it for your own work uh, camera wise you are getting the uh, this camera name i'm forgetting this uh, normal g cam uh, small g cam okay that is not i would i forgot the name so that is uh, these things are you are all having and uh, audio quality is fine and i used the this one bluetooth uh, things it is working uh, perfectly fine and the charging wise also it is it has a fast charge support so that is that so what are all the bad things well uh, there isn't much customization and second uh, it doesn't have any dedicated gaming mode or uh, this one uh, but uh, that is fine and uh, i have mentioned the issue right initially i thought it was having this uh, this one but i stay i accidentally found it is under the status bar also the battery is uh, i would say it is three years old so i can't complain that also <laughs> and the performance well performance wise whatever uh, the expectation the goal that i'm setting it is perfectly uh, fine in my opinion it, it takes some time sometimes to open to do any payment or something but at the end of the day it just works fine for my day to day use if you are asking bro uh, i need the latest uh, uh, stock rom suggest me one i am not uh, consider about customization and all i am just need a stable and i can expect the updates will be coming in a monthly or two months on at least um, for those people this one will be the uh, bit, uh, good options that uh, option that you can proceed further so yeah that's what about uh, this video actually and the installation of uh, this one may seems you boring or something by reading the instruction from the side if you want to uh, see the uh, how uh, to do it in a video or something you can watch this video so this video i have uh, installed it and if you want to watch if you are newly coming and you are seeing the how oh, i have bought this device what i can do well there is a dedicated playlist for the ma2 which you can click uh, this link and make sure you subscribe to this channel so i will be keeping this device okay you will get the updates don't worry ma2 guys jasmine sprout so also 6a 6x yeah thank you for watching code motor